losing weight, it's not just a physical thing. It's here and it's here. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up. Guess what? What? This is the specialist video on the planet. Yeah. Diet hacks or essentials. So we always get questions, comments. How do you stick to your diet and eat, you know, fairly clean all the time without always needing lots of treats? We got our secrets for you today. So we got it all lined up for you. So first, we may as well show you our favorite one. May as well get the big bang for your buck. Yeah. <laughs> so this is our favorite diet hack. We've been using this one for a very long time. This is sugar-free jello. It's marketed as fat-free, actually low calorie. It comes in little containers like this, or cartons, whatever you want to call it. So it's the five calories per cup with the no sugar added. And we, at our store, we get lime and, lime and strawberry. There are no carbs in it, no sugar, no fat, and only five calories per cup. So we usually have one of each. We discovered this fat-free Cool Whip. You can have three tablespoons, and we give ourselves three big tablespoons, and for three tablespoons, it's 25 calories, half of fat, five carbs, and two sugar. That is really good for a treat. And we have this once or twice a week when we're cutting, which is what's happening right now. And you have to have a little fun. We used to be super strict, but we don't count these sprinkles as sugar. We put a few on. Like, don't go nuts with them because they're they're just regular, you know, sugar sprinkles. But yeah. we found for us right now, because we're in a caloric deficit, that it's not affecting our results at all. So And it feels like you're eating, like, look at that. It feels like you're eating a really good dessert. And we feel satisfied after. We look forward to it. And it's just a little sprinkle. And like we always tell you guys, and this will come up often in these types of videos, Pick your battles. Yes, you need to enjoy life and enjoy the journey. Losing weight isn't just about the number and getting smaller, it's about the journey. If you hate the journey, guess what? You're not losing weight. If you don't like your food, you're not gonna stick to that no, diet. No, you're not. You might lose weight right away, but then you're gonna hate it and you're gonna backslide. And you're gonna fall off. Yeah, so you gotta love it. Pick your battles. Our next favorite thing, drinks. So we discovered this kombucha recently and some of you might go, um, that's not a treat. But for us, we get, this one is our favorite, the Trilogy. It is a treat. We have half a cup each. We measure it out every night and it's like, because it's, um, carbonated, it feels like a treat. So kombucha, like for, for anybody that doesn't know, it's fermented black tea mm -hmm. and it is, it boosts if your you don't know system. also it boosts your immune system because when you're dieting your immune system is compromised oh. so this is you know part of our repertoire that is needed for our dieting program also gut health this um when you're eating really clean and dieting you can get constipated that's the reality of it and this helps with immune system and the constipation and stuff and too. a lot of your immune system is contained in the gut so if your gut is all messed up you're not gonna poo. <laughs> <laughs> that and your immune system is extra at risk when you're lower in calories. Yes, so that kombucha comes in, not only helps us with our health, but we actually really like it. If you're not into diet pop, which we used to drink, I used to drink seven full sugar Dr. Peppers a day when we first started and I was 300 pounds. I switched over to diet soda and we drink a couple times a week. Yeah, it's not, not all every the, it's day. It's not every day thing. Um, usually on a Saturday or a Sunday as a little treat for the weekend. So we've got, this is naturally flavored. And these are our favorites at the current moment. And this one is the Coke Zero Orange Vanilla. We don't get this in Canada. We have a lovely lady friend who picked this up for us. She is awesome. This is currently our favorite. 
But if you're not wanting the, a lot of you often comment on the, the chemicals sweet, the sweet and the sweeteners. Nerves. So if you're not wanting that, there's also sparkling waters, which don't have any added sweeteners or chemicals in them. They're literally just naturally flavored sparkling water. And we like the bubbly from time to time. Yes, we do. And this one is lime. We also love the grapefruit and the strawberry. So these are amazing for needing a little boost or a little treat. Recently discovered these. You will need these in your life. Stevia sweetened chocolate chips. This is Krizda brand. I found these at Zares in Canada. I'm not sure where you would in the States. There is probably other brands of, of Stevia chocolate chips, but this is our favorite. This is the only one that we have available to us at the current moment, but I'm sure you can find some online. These are amazing. We literally put five or six, currently rating protein pancakes, we put five or six in our protein pancakes in the morning. You eat chocolate every day. It's a little treat and it's delicious and they're stevia sweetened and it keeps you on track because you get to eat chocolate chips. And if you want to see that protein pancake recipe, we just did a breakfast meal prep. Go check it out. I don't know what you would call these. Like, mix, let's call them mix-ins. Mix-ins. So like spices, I didn't put those here, but like cinnamon, nutmeg, ground cloves, pumpkin pie spice, those are great for flavoring things. Oatmeal, protein pancakes, that kind of stuff. Any any sort of clean meal that you're having will add to it along with these. This is unsweetened cocoa powder. We put this in our cottage cheese. I put it in my yogurt. We put it in our protein pancakes. Look at your shoulders, they're freaky looking. Oh my. <laughs> this is unsweetened baking cocoa. There is no sugar in it. It is just cocoa powder. And it goes great in Greek yogurt, in cottage cheese. Protein pancakes, protein shakes, unsweetened applesauce. I put this on plain rice cakes. I put some of this in my protein pancakes to make it more soft and fluffy. I put it on my pancakes. You can do a lot of stuff with unsweetened applesauce and or you can just eat it Sometimes I just measure out a quarter of a cup and eat it. It is delicious and it makes you feel like you're eating a treat without a ton of carbs and sugar. And yes, we do eat similar all the time, but it doesn't feel similar when we're when you got our trick. And change it up. Sometimes I put sweet potato baby food or carrot baby food in my pancakes or my oatmeal and it changes the game completely because you can make sweet potato protein pancakes I've made carrot cake flavored protein waffles, carrot cake flavored oatmeal. You can make carrot cake flavored protein shakes by putting carrot cake, carrot baby food in vanilla protein shakes. And people always ask why Nicole talks like a baby. Well, this is the reason. Cause I eat the baby food. This, this stuff is the old standby. No sugar added syrup. You can get sugar free. It's harder to get sugar free here in Canada. So we get the no sugar added. It is just as good. This is Mrs. Butterworth's. It's our favorite. It tastes the most like pancake syrup. It's amazing. We put it on protein pancakes. I use it to sweeten clean baked goods, protein baked goods. So if I make a protein pancake, sometimes I use that as the sweetener. You can use it as, um, to supplement in if you're baking something instead of sugar. This stuff I also have mixed into cottage cheese. I've mixed it into yogurt. You can pretty much flavor anything with it. If you like what you're hearing folks, you might want to check us out on Insta because we put a lot of these recipes on. There. Yes, we do. At the collects, baby. But not the baby part. Just at the collects. Get there now after the video. <laughs> Gum. Sugar-free gum. This is one of my favorites, peppermint cobalt, the five, I think it's called, five gum. This stuff is so good. So when you're losing weight, you probably will be hungry because you're in a caloric deficit. So sometimes, to curb my appetite, if it's between meals, I'll chew a piece of gum, and I feel like I'm having a treat, and it gets me to the next meal. Flavored teas and coffees. This is a flavored tea, cookies and cream. is actually really good and it actually does taste like cookies and cream. You put a little non-dairy milk in there and it's like a treat. 
We also have um, snickerdoodle flavored coffee. We switch our coffees and teas up, so it, that also feels like a treat. And we sit down and we have it together, so it's kind of like a date, and it makes it really fun. Another thing that we love, these are flavored extracts. You get them in your baking aisle. Caramel, almond, coconut, pure vanilla, and peppermint. They have nothing in them. They're just flavored extracts. You can get... Well, they have liquid extract in <laughs> they don't have nothing in them. There's, here? Hear that? There's something in there. So anyway, they don't have carbs, sugar, fat, anything like that. And a little goes a long way. We put that stuff... Just like your baby talk. <laughs> <laughs> put it in everything. Cottage cheese. Yogurt. You can put it in anything baked goods. Protein powder. I mean, protein shakes. Protein... Pancakes, waffles, muffins, whatever you do, protein bars, oatmeal, anything. It will change. It's a game changer. You can eat a different oatmeal every day of the week. Exactly. You can mix and match. You can put the almond extract with the carrot baby food and make yourself like a fancy thing. No, that's weird. No, it's no. not. It's not. I'm not. Doing Trust that. me. Next thing. And you can get like a million different sweeteners now like this is so exciting look at this this is a brown sugar alternative this is called sucrin gold i think that's how you say it i got this online on amazon canada it really does taste like brown sugar and it is the replacement so for one teaspoon there's four carbs there's no sugar, just the poly alcohols, the sugar alcohols. Which is carbs, basically. Basically, there's no fat and no calories. For one teaspoon, and you can feel like you're having brown sugar, you can use it in anything. You can put it in your, I put in my protein pancakes. I make chocolate chip pancakes, and you know how you make chocolate chip cookies with brown sugar? Hello. And like we always tell you guys, um, there's, We've been dieting for seven years. There is no such thing as willpower. We are all human beings. This you need to enjoy your food and this is how we do it. These are the tricks. This is what we do. Stevia. We put this in our cottage cheese, in our yogurt, sometimes in our protein pancakes and stuff. I just discovered this. This is sugar-free powdered sugar. Hello. Hi. I've used this to mix in Greek yogurt with powdered peanut butter to make sort of like a mousse. I've made my own sort of icing with it. What does a mousse sound like? <laughs> that sounds exactly like your baby impression. Uh... I don't know what a mousse no, sounds you, you like. No, you did it. You did it. High five. <laughs> Branch chain amino acids, or BCAAs for short. This stuff... You mix it in water. Not only does it contain vitamins and minerals, but it comes in really cool flavors like sweet tea. This is All Max Amino Core and the sweet tea flavor. It's awesome. It, it's amazing. In Canada, we call it iced tea. It's the same thing as sweet tea. And this actually tastes like sweet tea. It also comes in like pink lemonade, watermelon, blue raspberry. There are companies that sell candy flavored ones, and not only does it taste good, it helps you get your water in. And also, so, like the amino core has uh, B vitamins in it. Also, uh, like branch chain amino acids in a quick version, it helps you keep on, hold on to your muscle. Flavored cooking sprays. They really don't have anything except like half a fat in them, and what is this one? Four calories. So we the butter have one is really good. the butter one is so good. We sp like we make sweet potatoes and spray the outside with the butter flavor, or you spray the potato with the butter flavor. Also, we have extra virgin olive oil cooking spray. If you're making stir fries and stuff, you get the olive oil taste without the added fat. The same with the butter one. Well, you know what's really good? You have like, yeah, like a sweet potato or a potato. You spray a little bit of the butter flavored spray on top, salt and pepper. Oh boy. It's so good. Um, we've made mashed cauliflower and put the spray butter on it. We don't actually get spray butter here. So we use flavored butter cooking spray. 
as the same thing. Where there's a will, there's a way. And there's a bonus round. So this is, this one won't help you stay on track, but it is a diet hack. Because we don't, we eat berries for our fruit and apples. We don't eat a lot of bananas because they contain a lot of sugar. And we still want to get our potassium in. So we discovered no salt. Or this one is called salt free, salt substitute. Make sure you check, but most salt substitutes are actually just potassium. potassium. So this one is, look at that, 650 milligrams of potassium for a quarter of a teaspoon. We have two of these a day, one in the morning and one at night. And we've definitely noticed- it Gives us energy, it helps with our blood flow. I actually noticed like I was less bloated since I've been taking this too. I don't know if that's just in my head or what, but I have noticed that. Well, your head was pretty big before <laughs> and then after you took that, it shrunk. What is Your head still is big, but less big. Don't listen to him. <laughs> so, that's it. That's our okay. tricks of the trade. That's it. Leave any comments or questions down below. Don't forget to check us out on Instagram, okay? At the collects. And don't forget to like and subscribe. For what? For what? Jello glass. <laughs>Can you wear those inside? Yes. Into the gym. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye, guys.